Download this code and get free GPT-40 from CodeGive.com, link in the description below. eBuddy is a messaging application that allows users to chat with their friends across various platforms. Although it is not a widely recognized open source project, we can create a simple Java application that mimics a basic chat functionality, which you might find in a chat application like eBuddy. This tutorial will guide you on how to create a simple chat application using Java with sockets for networking. Hashtag 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 overview. We'll create a simple client server application. Server, listens for incoming connections and relays messages between clients. Client, connects to the server and sends slash receives messages. Hashtag 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 prerequisites. Basic knowledge of Java programming. An IDE, like IntelliJ IDEA or Eclipse, or any text editor. Java Development Kit, JDK, installed. Hashtag 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 step 1, setting up the server. 1. Create the server class that will handle client connections and message broadcasting. Hashtag 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 step 2, setting up the client. 2. Create the client class that can connect to the server and send messages. Hashtag 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 step 3, running the application. 1. Compile the server and client. Ensure both classes are in the same package or directory. Use javacchatserver.java and javacchatclient.java to compile. 2. Start the server. Run the chat server class first. It will start listening for client connections. 3. Start the client. Run the chat client class in a separate terminal or instance. You can run multiple clients to simulate multiple users. 4. Chat. Type messages in the client terminal, and they should appear in all connected clients. Hashtag 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 conclusion. This simple Java application demonstrates the core concepts of a chat application using sockets. You can extend this by adding features such as User authentication Storing chat history Implementing a GUI using Java Swing or Java FX This structure can serve as a foundation for more complex chat applications. Enjoy coding!